Well, the Blue Jackets find themselves in a tough spot tonight, down three games to none to the Penguins in this best of seven series. But Jody, in all three of the games, they have had a good start. In fact, in game three two nights ago here, they had a great start where they scored three times, but it still wasn't enough. Yeah, I tell you what, the crowd was electric, and they were, I don't know if they sat down for the first period. It was amazing. Uh, Cam Atkinson came out with that big goal, and this place went crazy. But at the end, the Penguins get it in overtime. The Blue Jackets were disappointed, but Bob, tonight at home, they just want to get this win for them and for their fans. The Penguins go with momentum shifts, and when they start to ride the wave, it can be a pretty big wave. Blue Jackets defenseman David Savard says they can't get caught up in that wave. They have to play a simple game. Yeah, you know, we, we can't change uh, the way we play. I think we when we play our game, we, we get chances, and we just got to, you know, stay focused. We can't can't panic in here. I think it's time to, to just rally again, uh, around each other and just play our game, and, and we'll be fine. We just need to, to get that first one. The veteran, David Savard, he's going to have an even bigger role here tonight with Zach Wierenski out. Quincy draws in. Now, he's got some playoff experience. I like him in the lineup. Expect him to play with Seth Jones. But those top four for the Blue Jackets defense, key tonight, and they're ready for this challenge. Absolutely. And I'll tell you somebody else that's coming back, Matt Calvert. He served a one-game suspension for a cross-check on Tom Kunakel after game two. And he says, coming back tonight, you're going to see him for what he always is. You know, you want to be out there helping your teammates. Uh, you know, I'm just going to come back, play my game, bring energy, play hard, and, uh, you know, try to help out the team. Matty Calvert back in the lineup. He brings that hard-nosed presence every single shift. He's a guy that the Blue Jackets look to in the locker room and on the ice. It's great to have him back. This will be a huge lift for the Blue Jackets tonight. And he's a guy that has scored key goals against the Pittsburgh yeah. Penguins in the playoffs, not only a couple of years ago, but he did have a goal earlier in this series. He's hard to play against, and he's a guy that just won't go away. He'll fight, uh, and he walks that line. So tonight with the Blue Jackets, I like what he said. He's got to come back with his game. Now, you mentioned some of the changes defensively defensively here tonight. Wierenski is out for the rest of the year. Marcus Nudevara is drawing in. Scott Harrington is out of the lineup tonight. Kyle Quincy comes in defensively for the Blue Jackets. But they have another player coming into the lineup too. As Scott Hartnell gets scratched tonight, Lucas Sedlak returns. Not a lot of people in the NHL would be saying, oh, Lucas Sedlak is back. That's going to be huge. But we're saying it here because he has been a big part of this team. All year long. And Hartnell, the veteran, is scratched. I mean, he's a guy that the Penguins don't like to play against. But John Tortorella is going with this. With Sedlak back and Calvert back from suspension, it creates a bit of a stronger center ice position. Sedlak has earned the coach's trust. He's reliable. And let me tell you something else. He draws attention, good attention, from the opposition because he just plays a hard style. Uh, he's a really a guy that's reliable in the defensive zone. This is a boost for the Blue Jackets. It moves Gagne to the left wing tonight. The right-handed shot will play the left side. And that's interesting. Torts likes Gagne on the wing better. This should be a fun lineup. The Blue Jackets are down three games to none. They're not going to win four games in one night. All year, John Tortorella has said, one day at a time. We win today. We worry about tomorrow, tomorrow. If they don't win today, there is no tomorrow. But that mindset has really been driven home for months, and it comes to roost today. Hey, right, Bob, and he's really worked on it. And hey, if you're going to eat an elephant, you can only eat it one bite at a time, right? <laughs> and tonight here at Nationwide Arena, the Blue Jackets have got to focus on each shift. Prepare for tonight's game the way they have all day. Come in and just take it slowly and play their game here, especially at home at Nationwide Arena. Beat the Penguins. Let's go. All summer, you're not going to be allowed into the Columbus Zoo. I can tell you that. Or the, at least they will lock up the elephants. That'll do it for the Rink Report. For Jody Shelley, I'm Bob McElligot. Enjoy the game.